you have to also adapt to the athlete too, right? Mm, yeah, yeah. Uh, when I look at the athletes, I, I categorize them in four different kind of body types. And they come from Asia, from China, uh, China and Japan, how they how they see martial arts, how they see the bodies. And uh, I think that when I looked at there are four times. The first type is the traditional kind of um, windmill kind of a, uh, stroke. Like, uh, for example, uh, Busquet hat. Yep. So you are very, very straight forward and you are keeping the hand uh, just uh, under your body and uh, you are rotating from your from your shoulders, but not so much from the hips. So that's the basic style we teach also in longer distances so that we kind of get, make the catch and rotate and keep it narrow. Mm -hmm. But then there is the other type, which is like uh, from Ovicio, from from Netherlands, mm -hmm. uh, who swims more from the sides. Mm -hmm. It's like the the ball power goes from the thighs to shoulders, crossing from here, and the and the stroke is powerful outside the body. Mm -hmm. If you if you watch, for example, her fifty or hundred, you can see that that uh, it it looks kind of a traditional kind of uh narrow but it's not it's more wide here and and she doesn't do that much of a push at the end or near the hip and then the third type is uh, like bruno perhaps who uses more more of the hips it's uh, i think that uh, caleb Dressel has that style usually they are very good jumpers usually they the gluteus are big they are like well they are like ice hockey players <laughs> mm -hmm. from yeah. lower, lower extreme and they are going kind of they are kind of not symmetrical in any ways. They can do different kind of uh, movements around and, and that makes them good athletes. And perhaps Bruno is like, uh, he has that ability to use the hip and then anchor with the hand because I've, I've seen him swim many times. I think that he anchors very strongly and, yeah. and he can sort of like throw himself over the anchor. So perhaps mm -hmm. that's power comes from the hips. And mm -hmm. then there's the fourth type who uses the back muscles a lot, like uh, like the South African uh, breaststroker winning the Olympics, the Sue Schumacher. Uh huh. Right. Yeah. Yo. Know, so who has very? She has a very strong back, so she's using the back muscles. So when mm -hmm. I see the swimmer the first time, I I watch kind of what, how he is moving, and what kind of a type he should be in the water. And you can see that how they walk and run and uh, sort of like behave also on dry land that you get clues how they can be in the water.